so here I am in Tomioka, Fukushima again. Um, I was asked online to do some more measurements of the air and also to do some measurements in the woods. And right now I'm uphill and this is the view on Tomioka. There's the sea. That's where the tsunami hit in. Um, I think the radiation uphill is quite high. Uh, and I have my dosimeter here. I will do some measurements. Just a so this is the radiation on one, one meter 50 high, something like that. It's 0 0.32. Something like that. That's quite high. I was also asked to do some measurements in dry soil. I'll do that as well. Um, I am at a spot where there used to be a house. It's empty right now. You see? So it is already cleaned up. But next to the spot there's some dry soil. Some trees. And there it's going to be quite high. I guess. So here's my dosimeter and I'm going to try the dry soil here. It's going up. Okay. I'm gonna change location a little bit to here. Uh, it's going more up. 1.34, something like that. 3.9. Okay. Let's go a little bit higher. Here. It's kind of the same. Okay. So, since I know that in some parts the radiation is much higher than this, we will go a little bit more into the woods. See you later. So right now I'm in front of a small piece of forest. As you can see, it's only small, but I think it's not uh, decontaminated. So um, I did some measurements already above the ground and it says, I'm not sure if you can see it. It says 0.66 microsievert per hour so it's already high above the ground um, I will go in just a little bit just a little bit because it's probably quite high just a sec there are a lot of insects and spiders and stuff so I'm not going to be too far well, and of course there's the radiation This is quite high as you can see and this is only three meters distance from a small road. Yep, it's not good. So I'm back at the hotel and as you just saw the radiation is quite high in some parts of Tomioka. Um, of course um, I'm advised not to go into the woods and I would advise you to do the same. Um, but I did it just to do some measurements. Uh, I'm sure in some part of the woods the radioactive uh, level will be much higher than what I have seen. Uh, but I didn't dare to go further. Um, and just to show you the point that it is indeed true that the radi uh, radioactive level, yes, sorry, um, is indeed quite high in some places. Um, to finish the day, uh, I will measure the radiation on my shoes. Just a sec. So, as you can see, the radiation inside the hotel is not that high. 
like to my shoes been contaminated probably oh not too bad maybe here oh looks like I'm completely fine yay so as you just saw the measurements I made today were pretty high um, these are all above average the average measurements of uh, radiations I've done uh, are all around 0 0.20 or 0 0.24 something between that so um, please don't think that the radiation is all up of uh, 0 0.34 or something like that that's not true that's absolutely not true most parts are super clean well, super clean uh, decontaminated and I think they're fine as long as you just don't go into the woods I will be here in Tomioka Fukushima for a few more days uh, next weekend I will visit Kawauchi and also I will visit uh, part of Tomioka in the red zone um, if you have any questions, if there's something that you think I need to do or I need to know, just leave a message in the comments and I will read them and I will respond and I will listen to you.